Hi guys, welcome back on my channel. VST here, Venice Please Tech. This time again, Samsung phone, gaming, epic. Very nice video, hopefully, but good also to the test. What do we want to put to the test? Samsung lately released an application on the Android Play Store, which allows you to update the driver for, let's say, the video card or the GPU inside your phone. And of course, we want to put it to the test. So we can see right here, guys, I have on the left, right corner, right corner, left corner, I have an indication of the frame rate. I've been doing some tests before, of course, doing this video for you. How you can enable your frame rate indication very easily. And this one here, you don't need that one. I just did this here for the test. So there is an application called Game Booster, which apparently boosts your games and your performance for the games. It has a paid version and also a free version. This right now is not needed because we just have the very same indication as the one that is absolutely natively support. So I'm just going to go and uninstall that one. But guys, in case you still wanna test it, please, you're more than welcome to do so. And let me know down below your observation into the comments. All right, guys, but first, first thing is first, so I wanna show you guys what Samsung did. So if you go into the Play Store, guys, and you search for Adreno, okay, you're gonna get here, second result is Samsung Game Driver. So it says Samsung Game Driver, Adreno, S20, N20. And actually there is a bit of information about this app. It's GPU driver or GPU stands for your graphic processing unit. The GPU or graphics processing unit is responsible for rendering images by performing rapid mathematical calculations. GPU drivers for enhanced gaming experience. Game drivers to enable best gaming experience would improve graphics performance on Galaxy devices. Yeah, I know it was too quick, but what is new here, this release supports the following games. So three games right now is the Black Desert, the Fortnite and the Call of Duty Mobile game driver support will continue to expand other games. So I did some searches on the internet and it says it's, it's pretty much really Samsung using this way to push new graphics driver updates to your phone, apparently making your experience better, optimizing it, you know, with the games you play. But first thing is first, how can you show the current frame rate on your phone? Very easy, guys. You just need to go to the developer settings, right? They're down below here. So the developer settings can be activated very easily. If you don't have them, guys, you just need to go to about phone. You need to go to software information, and then you need to tap, I think, seven times on the build number. Then you just need to go back, and you'll see something called developer settings here at the bottom. When you click this one, you need to scroll down a bit, and you just need to find an option that is called show refresh rate. So look what happens right now. When I remove it, boom, nothing here. When I put it on, boom, the refresh rate is here. So right now I don't have the latest Adreno drivers installed and I want directly to open Call of Duty so that we can just see really what happens. And by the way, see, when I put the game on, immediately the frame rate drops to 60 FPS. Okay, good. All right, I'm starting a new game here. Our idea will be to just see, you know, what the performance is like, what is the behavior. We can just see here the frame rate indication is the refresh rate is 60 frames per second, right? But we wanna see what is like the real practical in-game performance. Then I'm gonna quit the game, install the latest junior drivers, and then I'm gonna give it another go. And we're gonna see if there are any noticeable improvements. All right, so let me just do some tracks here, okay? And now right now Invincible, you know, in the beginning, Oops, not a good start. Okay, you know, it, <laughs> that happens to me, guys. That was quite easy, okay. Let me just, just gonna go again. Okay, let's try it one more time. We lost the lead, that's not good, by the way. Okay, that's not so bad. Okay, but you see guys, it is pretty much flawless performance, right? So what I'm gonna do right now, I'm just gonna quit the game and just make sure that really I exit the game, right? We're going to install the latest driver, right? In the same time, we're still gonna keep the FPS indicator and then I wanna see, has something improved or not? Let me just try to kill all the games right now, okay? We're gonna go again into the Play Store, then we're gonna search for Adreno, we're gonna go here to the Samsung Games driver, we're gonna press install, and now we're going to let the magic play. All right, waiting, it's actually below 20 megabytes. It's right now here on my phone already, all right? So let me just try to kill everything again, and I'm gonna put back Call of Duty. Let's see, guys, I'm, I'm really doubtful that we're gonna see something noticeable. 
just because you know it was already working very very nicely the way it was before this update if you use fortnite on this other game please let me know in the comments down below all right so let's see i'm just gonna go directly enter a new multiplayer game all right and yeah i'm so excited about that all right i think animation really the opening animation is, is pretty much a scene guys right now i can not notice any new optimizations but then again it's just because it was running so well before okay let's see okay let's see we're just gonna give it a try I know where the guys are coming, they usually come from here. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, I think I have a better day today, I think. I know where the guys are coming, man. Oh my, I'm, I'm unstoppable today. I am unstoppable, man. Stand by, man. Okay, okay, okay. Ah, oh, come on, come on! Oh man! What? Not another truck, man! Come on, come on! Ah! Woo! Okay, good, good, I good. I think I'm doing a great job here, guys. Two more trucks for me, man. I'm on a streak here. Maybe then I'm gonna just oh, get. Okay, good. You know, performance, I think, really flawless. You can just see, you know, no matter what you do and the way you play the game is still the same. So I will conclude now my testing, guys, and I'll let you know the feeling that I have based really on these practical tests. It is absolutely the same. I can really not notice any bit of improvements. Maybe if you play Fortnite or this other game, you can see a bit more. Let me know down below in the comments. Still, I think it's very much welcome from Samsung that they're doing updates like this, all right? So Samsung, nice job. Keep doing this, keep expanding the support games list. And guys, I really hope that you have liked this video. If that's the case, you know what to do. Maybe you can subscribe for my channel. And we're gonna catch up in my next video.